up, guys? John Keys. Hey, guys. Sure, Michael. Listen, we're back with another episode. <laughs> but this is not like this your average so crazy, episode, as, as, as you saw the, the, the opening of this. We're talking about what if your life depends on a pillow mm-hmm. for home defense on a pillow. safety. Now, the reason why we say that is because for home defense, you know, Adam and home defense guys, mm-hmm. they have whole setups, right? Mm-hmm. You got the gun, nightstand gun, you got a gun under the bed, you got a gun in the corner in the back of the house. If you have to move around. Yeah, they, 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 some of people have kill switches mm-hmm. with night vision and ballistic mm-hmm. plates. We're talking about this pillow as an added extra piece of security, mm-hmm. right? You know, you don't really have time to hop out your bed and throw nope. on a ballistic vest. Nope, no right? Kevlar. No, yeah, you don't have time to do that. I'm sure you're not sleeping with a riot shield next to your bed. Well, I don't know. Some you guys ever? might. Might have a riot shield. Mm-hmm. Well, guess I don't what? have one. RTS Tactical has made a practical riot shield. Mm-hmm. And I love it. In your pillow. So shout out to RTS Tactical. I met these guys at the Gundy's. And you know what? We'll throw the clip up there. I'm, I'm talking to the RTS Tactical guys. And Clint from Classic Firearms comes up to me with a, with a whole ballistic diaper on. That he's wearing? You'll see it. In under his clothes? Not under his clothes. On top of his clothes. Okay. Yeah, it was quite disturbing. He totally interrupted my conversation. Shout out to Clint. You're, you suck. But anyway... R- RTS Tactical sent us both ballistic pillows. When mm-hmm. I ch- when I told Shermike I was coming home with a ballistic pillow for us to try on the range and shoot up, he didn't believe me. I didn't. It's 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 a nice, it's a solid pillow, man. It is. And it's it's, it's soft. It's, it's also a pillow I mean, I sleep in real mine. life. It's a pillow in real life. It's well, a little. It's on the bed. I should have sleep with it, but it's on my bed. Right, right. And I don't sleep with this on the bed. I sleep with it next to the bed um, because I mean it's very unassuming. It's like a pillow in the mm-hmm. corner. You know, nobody's gonna assume mm-hmm. anything of it. But uh, but it's a real pillow. It's just a little high for me. So like I don't. I like my pillows a little flatter than this one is. Um, but let's just open this up and show you exactly what's inside here. So. As you saw in the drills in the beginning, we were able to hop up off the bed and literally throw your hands in the straps. They have mm-hmm. straps. Bam. Now you literally have a ballistic shield literally. that looks like a pillow. And I'm sure your assailants will get a kick out of that when they see you coming to think this guy's a moron. And then they're going to shoot the pillow mm-hmm. like a While dummy. shooting them in the head. <laughs> like a dummy. They're going to shoot the pillow like, I'm going to shoot this dummy through his pillow. Mm-hmm. No, you won't. Not if it's an RTS tactical pillow. At all. So we're going to unzip this. I mean, this is like some memory foam stuff, right? No, this, this is stuff not, is soft. Yeah, God. this is not cheap. I'm going to be honest with you. If it was a little thinner for me, I would love it. But yeah, it's memory foam. And bam, inside there... Here we go. Whole ballistic plate, size 20 by 13. Mm-hmm. This thing, so it's supposed to be slated to stop pistol rounds and shotgun calibers up to buckshot. Mm-hmm. So we're going to test And most all assailants that. are going to have pistols. Most, most assailants will have pistols, absolutely. But, you know, every now and again, they get bold, emboldened. That's and they'll true. come in with a shotgun mm-hmm. or a sawed off or something because they mm-hmm. saw it on a movie or some mm-hmm. crap. Um, so you're ready for either or. Pistol caliber. Or a shotgun or caliber shotgun. Up, to, yeah. up to buckshot. Up to buckshot. So yeah. we're going to shoot this with some 9 mils today, 115, 124 grain, and we're going to hit it with some bird shot and buckshot just to see how this thing holds up. Yeah, let's see. Let's see. Hopefully it doesn't tear it all to shreds. I may actually... I definitely recommend this, though. I, I'm going to need a new liner, such, by the way. Such an unassuming way oh, man. to keep yourself safe. And if you got to engage with some folks in your house, mm-hmm. I'm sure you guys have seen enough videos of people having to take on assailants, mm-hmm. and sometimes they do get shot. Yeah. You don't want to get shot. No. Go to RTS and get this pillow. Yeah, and I'm telling you, you saw the way, I mean, from my angle, you saw it like that thing. I was fully covered by, I mean, I'm talking about like from literally the bottom of my eyes all the way down to probably below my belly button, Mm -hmm. completely covered because that's how much, look at that, look at all that space there, right? So you're you're fully covered and the plate is the size of the pillow. Mm -hmm. Um, But yeah, this is not cheap stuff either, man. Look at that. You get a nice soft pillow case. I don't know if it's like, what? 1300 thread count or something. Wow. It's, it's kind of soft. I don't know about 1300. Yeah, yeah. But it's nice though. It's, but it's nice. But it's nice. <laughs> it's not the Egyptian cotton or but silk nice. or, but it's nice. <laughs> it's nice. All right, man, we're going to throw this thing up on some steel and see how it holds up against pistols and shotguns. Mm-hmm. Let's I'm excited. do it. I am too, man. Let's go. Let's go. All right, so we went on ahead and put the pillow on a steel target right here. We made sure it was five to seven yards away because that's where most self defense encounters happen in that distance, five to seven yards. And we're gonna see how it holds up against nine mil, 115 grain. Let's go. Yep, definitely more than six rounds. It's okay. By one. <laughs> sure, sure, what is that? What does the by one mean though? By Just one. tell me what the- what? It means I was only one over. It's better than eight. <laughs> you see, do you see what I gotta say? He's like, at least it wasn't eight. 
it's still a violation. <laughs> uh, what do you call that? A procedural. Procedural, <laughs> Sherm. Sure. Eh. All right. All right, so that's 12 rounds. You want to see how it holds up now or you want to hit it with the shotgun first? Let's see. Okay, all right, let's see how it holds up. All right, so let's see. pop this thing off. All right, guys, we don't have anything coming through the back. That's a great how sign. How far in did it go is the question. <laughs> that is the question. Are you going to fill it? Hey, I tell you what, this, this it's kind of balled up in here now too for some reason. Let's see. All right, so yeah, it, it definitely move the uh plate around oh yeah so oh yeah because of the rounds hitting it mm -hmm. it's gonna make it go in oh wow all right oh, okay he's balled up in there boy look at that all right so definitely straight through the foam right into the ballistic plate definitely went in the ballistic Anything plate the other side um no oh we have like some looks like a little bit of penetration here but but the round isn't in there. There's no rounds in, so and, and the, as you can see, nothing came out the back of the pillow. This is the front. Nothing came out the back. Went into the ballistic plate. Um, but yeah, I feel the rounds. John you says can, plate. It's not like an actual metal. Right, right. right. It's like some type of fiber wo woven. Mm -hmm. Again. Oh yeah, you can feel them. Yep, they're in there. They're in there. But well, they're not in you. That's, that's the point. That's the important part. Yep. So you're the, still alive to live another day. You're still alive. And you probably didn't take no damage because, like I said, there's no over penetration. Yeah, no, see anything. Nothing coming through there. And let's see how this thing handles a shotgun. Yeah. All right. As you can see, 147 grain hollow points. See how that, how, how that holds up. All right. Let's go look at it real quick. Just so there's no mistaking about what we're seeing. Ugh. Right. Still, still nothing. Still no penetration out the back. Yeah. That's fine. We don't need to go in deeper than that. We'll take it off of when we finish with the shotgun. We did uh what what is it? 115? 115. 115. We did 147. 147. Uh hollow defensive point defensive round. round. Yep. And now we're going bird shot, buckshot, bird shot, buckshot, buckshot. All right. With Ready? the Panzer BP12. Bought that on Classic Firearms. Shout out to Classic Firearms. Man, that's, that's, some, that's some damage. That is. You want to check it out? You want just go ahead. I don't get to shoot this thing often at See, all. Shot in a long time, right? <laughs> I know, right? I don't get to shoot this thing at all. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, good. We got to do a review on the Panzer BP-12, guys. We haven't guys. done a review on the... We were supposed yeah, to. we were supposed to. We'll do a review ago. on this, guys. Let us know in the comments if you want to see a full review on the Panzer BP-12. They need to send me one of those. They you do need to pay well, for it, right? I paid for this. This yeah. was this was before Guns Out. This was a before Guns Out purchase. Well, I need one since Guns Out. I don't know how I feel about this one, John. Hey, that's just, but that's just gratifying. Man, see? Right. Hey, look, and that was seven yards away. That's pretty significant, guys. Ooh. It is. I would be surprised if there is no penetration, dude. Look at that. Wow. And you guys saw real time. Wow. Look at that. I balled this thing up on the inside, though. Look at that. Wow. Look at that. All right, we're gonna let's take this over back to the table. That's we'll impressive. open it up. Undo these straps here. Man, look at that. Look at that, man. Wow. This could have been your body. Mm -hmm. This could have been in your body had you not had something like this next to the bed or on your bed. Look now, at all. I hope you got an extra one. No, I don't, but dude, I'm sure I'll get an extra one. But look at that, man. I mean, look. No, it didn't even go through the panel. No. You see some charring there this this came out the other side look at that look you got all the bird mm -hmm. shot right there you got the projectiles Ooh, look at that look at that right wow there. oh we, we stacked one right here sure somebody stacked one that's impressive man yeah. this stuff works yeah man look at that you got the what do they call this i forget what they call this the little plug or whatever that, that goes in the in the thing to pack the shotgun around look at that all of that uh, that's impressive you see that's the material inside some type Either of ballistic way, this stuff works. woven. Look at that. It's damage. Life-saving stuff here. Life-saving stuff. So, for anybody, look, I'm still pulling out. I'm still pulling out projectiles, guys. RTS Tactical. Check them out. Legit. Look it up. 
This is legit ballistics, guys. Nothing came out the other side. I'm happy to know that this will keep me safe. Oh, don't you feel better about it now? Did, now you have that better. Now mm -hmm. I definitely want mine back now. Mm -hmm. we, so RTS, y'all gotta send me another one because we just proved that this works. It says it right here, be fearless. Now you can be fearless, Be right? fearless, I'm already fearless. You are, but now you can be more fearless. More fearless, that's right. Fearless, sir. Not a word, but. Fearless, 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 er. <laughs> <laughs> Pick that up with Daniel Webster. Yep, yep, there you go. Bing. Fearless, sir. Anyway, that's it, guys. RTS Tactical Ballistic Pillow. That's how we do it. Egyptian cotton pillowcase. So let's go and get some. <laughs>